The following presentation is rated Web G for general audiences. Previously on Welcome to the Family. Bert and I ride Harleys exclusively. Miles, on the other hand, wants to take the other route. I wanted to get a sports bike. How long can you stay like that? I don't agree with him. I was about the to way they're building bikes today, second to none, and they're custom. Here's my plan for the Pokemon. You know, I'll have bikinis made for them. Anyone can entertain you, but only we entertain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Are you ready? Welcome to the family. Mom away to get a sleeve study. Because <laughs> everybody's been saying how tired I look. I have been a little exhausted. So Bert has been having disturbed sleep lately, where I'm observing him when he's sleeping and I see that he's almost stopping when he's breathing and it got me really scared. So everybody recommended that I do a sleep study. So I had to really convince him and work really hard to get him to go do that sleep study. I really want to do this. Here for the sleep study. This is freaky. You gotta go up the second the floor. A sleep study is something that they do when you're having an issue sleeping. Either you're snoring too loud or you're having sleep apnea. It's not really the most fun thing to do. I made it to my sleep study. Let me show you around. I have two cameras. One camera, two camera, and an infrared. And then they have a bunch of equipment over here. My armoire in my window. Not bad. Pretty comfortable. One of the reasons that I'm having issues with my sleeping patterns is because I've gained over 60 pounds since I had my incident last year with the diverticulitis and all the medication and the processes they made me go through in the hospital. The weight gain obviously has given me issues with my sleeping. I am here in a club bed with DJ pillows scratching the Z's. <laughs> However, everyone that travels with me, especially Alexa, tells me it's a major issue. I kind of snore to the point that I choke myself. <laughs> so what is that? You're like putting all those things EKGs. in? EKGs. EKGs. What's that for? For leg movement. Oh, to see my leg moves? Exactly. Yeah, your leg moves. Yeah, and legs. They put all these cables around you and it's really uncomfortable. So what do I look like? A little dark. I don't know if you'll be able to see me. Good night, and I will see you tomorrow. Just finished it. Exhausted. It's six thirty in the morning. But just sticky stuff all over the place. It seemed to have been positive. I should end up with a machine like this. Other than that, I'm exhausted. I gotta go home, shower, and. Take a nap. Okay, so back at the house, we had an interesting discussion about the proper use of Instagram. For the most part on Instagram, I like to see photos uh, that are just, uh, look like they've been taken by professionals. I'm very visual, so I like to see other people's pictures and how they live their life and so forth. I know he yeah. went to New York, but. and I saw the pictures of New York, mm -hmm. but right. you weren't in them. Yeah, like two. Putting yourself in the pictures at times is cool. However, I don't enjoy those people that all they do is put selfies. Up uh, like LJ? I do it for sharing with your public. Yeah. Okay. So <laughs> I, I do it for the fans. It's not narcissistic. What? This is what you just said. Yeah, but but it, I think they want to see me. I like to think I was doing selfies before selfies were popular, because I always used to take pictures of myself because I'm a narcissist. Then like right now I'm like I haven't posted in three days, so I'll post every couple. I'll be the only one that's honest here. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, yeah, this is good. I believe in Bert Oliva's 33, 33, 33% rule. We have a rule that I call the 33% rule where you actually put your personal life, you put your professional life, and you put up your hobbies. Yeah. My hobby is my family. You know what? If you were not part of the team, I would drop you. If you're using it to kind of grow your business or your own brand, there's different ways of managing that where you can balance what you post. I 
kind of don't follow those rules. I just kind of post whenever I want to of whatever I want to, so it's kind of a hodgepodge. Because people that just post pictures of selfies of themselves, of, of me, 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 but me, 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 me,